Sonny Donnelly, IFL TV in association with MGM Marbella. I'm here with Paul Butler at the Epstein Theatre in Liverpool, ahead of his fight with Garnica. Paul, how are you feeling? I feel good, Wayne's done now, so time to refuel and, and, and get focused for tomorrow night. Would you be right, Would you be more up for the fight if it was for a world title? A, a lot more, yeah. A um, bit disappointed it's not for the world title, but you've got to get on with things, you've got to be professional in this sport, and if it was to overlook this kid, then he could, he could be a problem, but you've got to stay focused, stay switched on, and, and deal with him tomorrow. Looking at him weighing in, do you think he was looking a bit off shape, or do you reckon he was you know looking what, I, did, I didn't even have a look. Um, I just done the head to head of him. Didn't have a look at his condition or nothing. Uh, to be honest with you, I'm not too interested. I've just got to get in there and, and do what I do. And, and if I get in there fully focused, then I'll take him out. Are you feeling good and fit just before the fight? Yeah, I was. I was, I was the best I've ever felt uh, in training in the run up to Tete. So we just carried carried on from that that training. Really a bit disappointing for a week or two, and then um, we, we cracked on again. But. Like I say, we're ready to go and it's the best I've ever felt. So just obviously uh, Tete pulled out a bit late. Is there anything in training you had to change? Just like shaping up for the fight with Garnica instead? Uh, all it was was changing the sparring from up, from a southpaw to orthodox. Um, other than that, we just, we, we've just cracked on, really. Okay, then well hopefully it's a win tomorrow and we get to interview after that, alright? Yeah, definitely. Enjoy the rest of your night and I'll see you tomorrow, mate. Cheers, mate. Thanks.